Welcome! Like what I promised before, I'm gonna make another one. So, it's book two. Alright, this, unlike the first one, like I kinda trash talked this one. Yeah, oh, Jesus. Uh, it's a book. It's a book. Uh, it doesn't mean a lot. Okay, so the second one is actually pretty good. If you don't like it, that's fine. I enjoy it. Same to a lot of other pe a lot of other people. So, let's not waste any time. This is original heroes, and this was also made 2018 June. All right, let's get started. It's also a little shorter, and it's a lot, a lot better writing. But there's a few plot holes that is filled in the third book, which is in that pile. So, let's go. Chapter one. Some news. Hmm. You and Batman. Okay. You and Batman saved Hollywood. You, you two can come to the town hall for your money. <clears throat> you two will be going tomorrow evening. I hope you go and get your enemy, Rickard. And bring Lila. Thank you. Rick is dead meat. Alright, he's dead. Yeah, I hope. No! You're all done. Take a look. Your hair. Your hair is so... Your hair is messed up from the hair being too thick. Because if you do not know, Rick has really thick hair. Look at that tall freaking hair. That's tall. So, stop. I look so horrible like this. Because he looks like his brother. He's just roasting his brother. I should at least get a hat or some or some wig on my I understand. No, 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 no. No make up your mind. At least I'm giving you a choice. A hat. Fine. Don't don't just find me. You wanna fight? Yeah, sure. Well guess what? That is not realistic. I think. If cops actually do that, um, I'd be a very surprised. Chapter 2, the cousin's coming. And this person is a fat idiot that it appears in the series to be a lot more smarter and nice. But he's just a character right now. Mm. Come in. Let's stop by to, to, if, to go to the washroom. Wash them sure, it's right over there. Let's go let And then Rick kills the officer, rips his arm off. And then and then shoots him. And non pleasant surprise, but to be honest, I don't really give a f damn fuck about him. Alright. Time to go no I Time to get that great hat that fits me. I'm gonna get Batman and Chloe. Don't know but just speaking. Is there another problem? Yes. For now, for Butt City, for Butt City to get great again. No, don't know but seriously, what is the problem? I don't wanna go. I don't want to go here for that. After this, after this, but no more people of Butt City will go. Yes. But except for for Butt dogs and cats. And don't worry, Fluffy and Bony. I was about to say Boner. I thought that I thought that was an R. Just Boner. You guys won't go. Yeah, but don't worry. Only kit, only kittens and pups will go. Forget what I said, okay? We always do. Yeah. Now, as he is, as, as he has depression. All right. This egg is now gone. Plop flush. <gasps> he just shit an ass. Whoa! So big. Totally not what happened in the last one. At least this book is better. Chapter four again. Can I go for the walk? Sure. Hello. Hi. 
I thought I was the only one from Butt City, same. And it's all that weird romantic stuff. Rick wants to go and try to chase down Chloe, Chloe and Buttman. And then Chloe gets something. Gets a call from Buttman. Then his phone broke. In the car. Good. <laughs> I want to be a cop now. I'm pretty sure if you just went to a police station. Okay, imagine this. If... If you got a call from an ass-looking freak, and, you ju and you're just, like, running to your car, get in my car! Get in my car, 15-year-old! And then you just... And then you're just like, I want to be a cop now! I'm pretty sure they would arrest you on the spot. Doesn't matter what story it is, they would think you're a fucking psychopath. Cops, too. Shepard Johnson. Chloe Heard. Thank you. When Chloe and Joey came, there was a very big problem. Wanna run? Sure. Ah! I just had to make it realistic. There we go. Meanwhile, hello. Run. Don't worry, calm down. Why? I control them. I made them. Don't worry. Wanna team up? Sure. Sure. I have broke my my voice though. Yeah, I broke my voice forever. Oh no, I'm kidding. My voice is still alive. Meanwhile, kaboom. His car exploded and Joey fell on him. Man, wait. Why is he talking from there, hey? Why is he talking from there? A flipperama! This shit again. Alright, let's get over with this. Oh no, it's so, so bad. I just met up with him. Was... <coughs> okay, since since I said he can take a walk, this is my fault. Oh no. And then he starts fucking crying, like a baby. Chapter 7, meet up. Bam, blong. Uh, 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 I will kill everyone. Everyone. Ah. Uh. Ah! Uh, ouch. But man, yes. Hi. Ah. Oof. It's fucking. S Kaboom. There. All right. Later. Tuesday. Bye, Chloe. Bye. Hi, Joey. And then they just notice that, that, um, they have some relationship. And they walk. Let's go. Where are they going? Alright. Haha, uh -huh, help. Never. Okay. And then, Donald Butt, out of nowhere, Donald, I'll call him Donald Trump for one time, kills Rick. Splat. Next day. Oh. Uh, then. Buttman tries to go investigate who killed Rick. And everyone knows it's Donald Butt. Alright, well, thanks for watching. I hope this was funny enough. Because. I didn't put any jokes in here. This is all just dead. Now, thank you for watching. I will see you later. Thank you for 620 subscribers. I really appreciate it. Now, well, I'm gonna go and read the third book, which I'm gonna publish probably today as well. Maybe, maybe tomorrow, maybe the next day, I don't really know. Keeping my promise with the few weeks reading all those books, though. Keeping that promise. Well, goodbye!